thing cheap. A little bit bad. A little like twerp wrong. A lot of people. Ugh. I give it like a three. Yeah, yeah, he looking a little confused. They got the monkey shoulder. This is serious. Just about getting out and not being afraid to make the mistakes. Dad, yeah. I have something for you. What's up? That I want to share. I wanted to share this with you because yeah. you buy this for uh, me. Let's go to I, city center. I love you because you're the best dad ever. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. Yeah. <laughs> you got some toys for the baby? Yeah, I bring this my suitcase so so I can bring some toys for the baby. Okay, let's get going. All right, so we're getting ready to go now. I showed you guys the market last week, um, but we're just gonna go to Walmart this time. Just pick up like our um, uh, just like a, the base stuff that we get. Most of the fruits and vegetables we try to get from the market now, but Walmart is where we started shopping. And it's typically what like most expats will do as soon as they get here. There are some things that you need to know when you're shopping like outside of the US. Bring grocery bags. Not all places support plastic. Yeah, plastic bags suck. So one of the things that you have to deal with is having an international bank. I think in the consultation service, we talk a little bit about that and how to basically cover it so you don't have to keep switching your money around like we've tried one two five six uh seven different banks since we started traveling maybe even more what? that we've tried like banks bank of america wells fargo um, credit unions charles schwab like i got all these toys for the baby look Ooh. look i got this hair brush for me when, I, when my hair gets all tangled. And I got this for, for my for my brother. That's <laughs> my mom right there. <laughs> so that's why I got this. And I know I like butterflies. My dad likes me. And I like pink and purple. You know that right now. So that's why I'm bringing baby toys. Also, side note, because I try to mix like traveling tips with also like our family life. One of the things that I was, I'm doing is I'm, I teach right now and it takes up a little bit of my time, not a lot, but I'm switching to doing like more um, day trading or like financial things to provide for us because I feel like it'll give me more freedom and also help me just be a better dad. I'll be, I'll have more time with Nina. It's the goal, it's the goal. What are we here to get? Groceries and then maybe a, bit, a bath for him. Maybe a bath, okay. And then anything else on our list? I took a picture of the whiteboard. Okay. You got to climb up. Yeah! You're not having fun? You look like you're having fun. No? You can't hide from me. You can't hide the fun now, we're gonna cry! This worked out well. He I thought I was awake for a second. Now he's asleep. We need to get some things for the house. Our house has been really dusty. We sweep every day. I don't know what is going on. This music is so loud. Hold on. Parenting tip number 35. Always get wipes. You say? I want to go over there. We can't get through here in another space. Here I come. I know exactly what you need. Burger toy, burger toy. You can't hide your smile. You can't hide your little smile. You're so cute. Good job. You see, Nina, it's not fitting. Try and push harder, Becca, try and push harder. Oh, snap. <laughs> I didn't think you was gonna go that. So there are little subtle differences in the Walmart. Just the signage and being able to see. You don't need to know Spanish to navigate the Walmart. Yeah, I told you to eat some Similac. You hungry, right? I can't open it. Well, that's not my fault. So you can still be able to um, 
order food, but you need to know like, I don't know, I wouldn't say a little Spanish, but download the Translate app so you can actually, you did open it. Now go ahead, get you a little spoonful of that Simulac. Whoa, wait, 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 I'm just playing, I'm just playing. <laughs> You can ask in a different way. Why don't you calm yourself down first? Yeah, get your shoulders back. Get your shoulders. Get your shoulders. <laughs> Relax. Sit up. Sit up. Breathe. There, there go. we go. Now ask again. Hey, Mom, can yeah. I have a snack? Yes, we will look for something for you. So you got some of the back, right? Make sure Man, you know. Cam want me to do everything. Wait. Future Becca, when you're watching this video, just know what I got right before the camera started. Because he wants me to do everything, get the meals, buy all this stuff, do the video. He's just playing around over there. Hey, I like that. So I remember with the market video, I got rice and it was 19 pesos. So it looks like this rice here is the same price as the one at the market, but this is actually double the price. It's 40 pesos, um, but it's parboiled. So. I like parboiled rice. Okay, you can still find the same prices for things at Walmart as you do at the market. So just look out for that. I think this is barley. Is that barley? I, think it's barley? I don't know the name, but it looks like it. Yeah. So you can still get your almond milk too. Walmart is where you can get the brands that you are used to. And Shijarawi is another place you can get the stuff. Like it's a little bit more expensive, I think, but definitely check the prices and you're not going to get things much cheaper here than in the states now prices are going up on stuff too so looking at me what so those oreos are looking at me. Ugh. oh i think i've said this in videos before too um, on all the packages it tells you excessive calories excessive sugars and i really like this on all the packages and in the u.s they don't really tell you that your food is is killing you so you just kind of have to you know get sick and then intuit it later in life Did you get milk? there's one on sale too right there in front of you with the red the red tag this? left 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 oh. what that thing cheap <laughs> i like shopping at chajari baby why they just have more of the stuff that I like, like there are these date bars. They have tofu out. I've never seen tofu at Walmart. They just have a better selection of the things I personally like. Okay. <laughs> so yeah. They have the brands that well they don't have all the brands you you might be used to. I'm not eating it. But um you know if if these are the things you like, you can get them. You just have to find specific places that have them. Um, yeah, like brags. Oh, nah, I'm good. Mr. Tofu is another place that we have to do a video on. They have a lot of stuff. Like, it's like the vegan, um, market. And then also, um, yo, we're going to do a whole video on grocery stores. I just realized that. That's what we should do. I got two bags open. But you can empty it into that. Yeah. <laughs> you all right? <laughs> oh, you know what? We gotta understand, we're not the only people on our channel. We don't eat meat, but I'm gonna go show the meat section. I mean, it's a meat section at Walmart. I mean, Who hasn't yeah, seen it? Bone broth, so that's yeah, I'm gonna go show the meat section. I don't know if people are curious. Somebody tell me in the comments if you care about a meat section at Walmart. But yeah, they have some like, so, oh snap. Wow. At Walmart, interesting. I guess it is a little bit different. I don't know if this is, different than what you're used to this is different for me like a whole like actually the whole front of this chicken that's wild what is this what is it oh nah what is that okay yeah let's let's be out all right let's be out here so this is the bread section right here got all your breads did you get one which one you get Okay, smooth. They're a little bit spicy though, Daddy. I am. It's a little bit bad. That's how pork rinds are supposed to taste. Oh, you like pork rinds. A lot of people. Yeah. Like I said, you can get the brands that you want. I like this milk. I don't get it because it's a little bit more expensive. Um, but 
you can find the brands that you like as well. Okay, see, see. We got, because um, they were saying, like, you could get that one. But that was just a discount. And I was like, oh, no, I don't like that flavor. But they said it's for free. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 I've only seen them like small, like individual size. Like Fun de Muerto, okay. Wait, this isn't the one where you find the thing and you have to pay a whole no, bunch of money. That's the Rosca, Rosca de Reyes. Oh, okay. That's the where you find the little baby? That's yeah. King's Day. That's, that's fire. In January. Yeah? yeah. It definitely looks like a Columbus. Yeah, they got tons of produce here. Whoa, look at how many things. I mean. Look how many onions, it goes all the way down. This is not, this is like a garbage bag. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot he was on my chest and he moved. Like he like put his finger in my chest and he like squirmed and I was like, we need to go to the hospital, I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> tastes like dog food. Hey, they got dragon fruit here, okay. You gotta be careful when picking dragon fruit turn it on one side it may look like this on one side and this on the other nice little proto produce section actually I would say this Walmart's better than the Walmart's I've been to yo can you get oyster mushrooms not these ones yeah they're up top out of all the Walmarts this like in Merida what <laughs> Nina's getting to you Cause man, we're not addressing the tone. It's hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh no. Let's go to Subway. Okay. <laughs> Let's go to the fruiteria and get fruit and then we'll just, okay. yeah, just to survive till Monday and then I'll go to the market on Monday and get fruit. Nina, we're gonna go get sandwiches after this, okay? Yeah. Got a weird teriyaki vegan sandwich I'm about to try. I'm probably gonna regret it, but we're gonna try it. This cream cheese is a necessity. Necessity. And I wish they had the bigger hummuses too. So that hummus is a necessity as well. really don't be in Walmart like that but I guess it's like supposed to be packed just like the typical stuff you would get at the grocery store maybe like some frozen fruits some uh, fruits some uh, bread coconut water some eggs uh, just like a li just supplementary things not really like the, the bulk of what it is um, but we'll see how much it costs there's like some more stuff down here just to kind of give you an idea of what it is that we got so like some chickpeas um, almond milk, yeah. We can, we can ever, we, when, when we go to the store again, we can, we can hang this up as a, as an ornament tree for our ornament. That's nice. Because there's a snack inside. There is a See? snack inside. Right there? But I think it got milk in it. Yeah. So, so, so we're going to do this tomorrow. <laughs> I don't know about tomorrow. Whitney Houston? You lost the card? Yeah. You sure? Let's got it. <laughs> Trying to play a trick on dad? Yeah. Oh wait, isn't that George Michaels? Yeah. I never heard like songs by him. You heard this one? No, I haven't. You've never heard this never song? Heard Whoa. <laughs> what? What? 
I can't tell if this is me or that girl behind me with the glasses is me. <laughs> How much that come out to? 127. So it's 2,000 in here. So 127. Okay. 127 dollars. Not bad. It's not bad. Cause what? We usually usually spend like two, two hundred every yeah. time we go to the grocery store. I don't know how long this is gonna last us though. A week. Maybe not even. even. <laughs> so we're gonna. Cam said he saw some veggie special veggie sandwich or something at Subway one day. So we're gonna see if they have it today. But yeah, this is city center. There's like a bunch of other little shops outside the Walmart. There you can get your hair cut. You can buy a phone plan. Buy a bed. Um, there's like pet store. There's like a mini so little store with a bunch of trinkets. That is where we bought our beds, yeah. Yeah, it's not looking like oh, they no. have it. There what? it is right there. Oh. Teriyaki veg. I can't see it, but there's a glare. Yeah, they got it. They got the teriyaki veg. So let's see if we got it. Yes. We're about to get a sandwich right now. Are you? You are. All right, so they got the, look at the veggies that you might want. The veggies. I cucumber. Cucumber? Yeah. Okay. You'll get some. Risking life and limb. Hey man, we just seen the guy from. What does he do? It's like. Uh, so he like asked people to donate for a certain Let's go that way. <laughs> <laughs> It's not bad. It's not bad. It's better than I thought it was gonna be. It's like I give it like a three. <laughs> three out of ten. <laughs> Just use the sides. Remember what we did? One hand. The other hand. No, the other hand first. No. One foot. Yo, no, Nina, hands. Keep both your hands on. One foot. Bring yourself close. Yeah. That's good. Breathe it out. Breathe it out. Use your arms. Use your arms to... Bring it close, bring it close. Hug the pole, close. There we go. Yeah, part of me is like, I shouldn't eat the rest of the sandwich. Like I can feel like a low grumble deep down in there. But the other half of me is, is saying, I really should. We're never doing that again. It's honestly not safe to eat anywhere. Like, people just don't care about the places they work anymore. And I totally get it. So, um, I think I'm going to eat it.
one thing too that we're gonna check out this liquor store over here but one thing too i don't know if you can see let me try to zoom in there are these birds nests and some of these times some of the times of the day you see all the birds out and there's they don't get rid of them they just let the birds make nests here it's amazing it looks like they're setting something up behind this sign dia de los muertos Oh, something for pets, something for dogs. So yeah, Nina really wants a picture with this cat thing over here. So there's a huge liquor store. Let's go in. Let's see what we got. They wind it up. Let's see. Let's see. I don't. I've never been in here. Yeah. So. Buenos dias. Yeah. It's huge. It's big. Look at that. Wow. And so look, we have the ones. Wow. This is nice. This is very nice. Whoa! It's got like a meat, cheese, and bread section. Yeah, I've never been in here. Wow. It even has pasta. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, it goes back even further. Okay. Well, we have four minutes on the Uber, so I'm not able to do like a detailed. What is that back there? Oh, whoa. The heck? Is this open? Oh, I guess. You need a, oh, it's locked. It's like a room. Wow, okay, we're not going back there. Let's go this way. <laughs> you can see it just goes on for a while, man. Okay, so where are we at? This is France, and then you have Champagne. And then just, is it all wine? It can't be all wine. It can't be all wine. Whoa. I didn't think I didn't think it was this huge in here. Yeah, Becca's gonna be surprised when she sees it. No, it's not just one. That's just I think the majority of it is just one. Okay, cool. So we have Jameson right here. Yeah, that's some some stuff that I recognize. Uh, oh, they got the monkey shoulder. Serious. This is serious. Oh. Okay, wow, okay. You know, I bet, let me check. Cause Nick, Nick was very, very, uh, my friend of mine was very, very um, particular about his Hennessy. Let's see, uh, they have Hennessy. Let's see. And let me know if there's anything you recognize that I should probably try. Because, again, I haven't tried a lot of stuff, and I don't really know what's what. But, yeah, let me know if there's some stuff you think I should try. Where is it? I don't know. I don't see Hennessy. Let's see. Let's see if they have the Hennessy white, like uh, Nick was saying. Hennessy? Uh, let me see. Nah, they don't have it. I guess this is, he said the cognac, this is all they have over here. So no, I don't see any Hennessy though. Nope, maybe I need to look a little harder. Uh, but, oh well, that's it. So the Uber is on the way. Uh, I think it's like here now, so we have to go. Let's see. Oh, that's some nice art. Well, we're looking for a gray Mazda. Uh, and also, City Center has the banks too. So if you come down here and you need a bank, like you need to get money out of the ATM, they have a Starbucks over here. But let's find that car before they leave us. Already getting ready for Christmas. Oh, there we go, right there. Great monster. <laughs> <laughs> okay.
can't believe I ate that Subway. I can't believe you did either. Yeah, it was, um, that was a bad decision. My stomach Terrible. was like, what, what are you doing? <laughs> hey, I, didn't, I, I just left the mine on the bench. Like, yeah, I, yeah, it was, I took my, scraped mine off of the sandwich. <laughs> yeah, it was terrible. Sandwich. Yeah, it was bad. Okay. So we made it back home. I didn't really eat that sandwich. Nina did not eat that sandwich, so we're making her some ramen. Wow. Whoa, bro. Right, and uh, yeah, Julian is still asleep. Big day for him at the house. And yeah, we still have to go to the Fruitaria later today. And then I don't know, just chill, hopefully, because I'm tired. <laughs> Somebody's a little upset, but it's okay. It's okay. Dad got you. Dad got you. All right, I got you. Yeah, don't worry. Don't worry. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, yeah, you looking a little confused. <laughs> You're supposed to let me walk out the house looking like this. Like what, bro? I don't even know what you're talking about. Yeah. How are you supposed to look? I don't know. Not with my hair. Like, um, I don't know. I don't even know what you're talking about. I, I really think that you should have that one right there and there. Midday in Merida. Nice sunshine. It's not as hot today. I did want to say, actually, I wanted you to kind of chime in on this too. Like, we need to do a video about being in Merida and it not being maybe the right choice for you as well. There are other places in the world that are also like not affordable, but you may just want something different. If you don't like the heat, yeah, if you don't like the heat, don't yeah. come to Merida. Yeah, but like it's kind of expensive compared to like other expat, like yeah yeah it's a little different um i like it i like the people i like the community i like the um it's not super expensive vegan food is not yeah vegan food is, mm, it's, 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 it's much to be desired but yeah like right now we're able to just walk up the street and get fruits and you know the uh transportation is not difficult you can get a ride almost anywhere uh, if you have the right. Single person. If you're a single person, the dating pool it's might not, not be it's great. Like, it's also it's just like a very family city. Like there's not <coughs> much to do. There's nightlife, yeah. but it's not all that. Like you're better off going to like Medellin. Yeah, or maybe yeah, even another part of Mexico. Mexico. Yeah, it's really just about getting out and not being afraid to make the mistakes. Not being afraid to be in a place that you really don't like that much. Like, we went to Bali. We didn't really like it that much. Like, it was good, but we realized that there was some other place that we probably would like a little bit better. And we, we got to know what kind of things are, you know, like our um, non-negotiables. And I think uh, when we got, because Hong Kong was awful, but the city was beautiful. Yo, I would go to Hong Kong. I, I would. I was not expecting it to be that expensive. Yeah, it was expensive, and the rooms were small. So if oh, we could yeah. figure some way to like balance that. But Thailand was cool. We just didn't explore as much. We were kind of, we you know, Nina was young. But Vietnam was like it. Vietnam, like the whole country, like Hanoi, Saigon, Da Nang, all like all the places we went it was it it was perfect so like my i think my dad's going to i think panama no he's going to panama um or portugal uh so there's there's a lot of places people are looking at and let me know if, if you have some places you're thinking about going uh we may have some people who are already out here who may have lived there huh oh yeah we're thinking about uh going to medellin and i think our friends are going this weekend too so Medellin is also a thing, Colombia. Right across the street is a park. And they have like courts and fields. We're gonna go after this car. Are they playing for like football too? Let's see if we can catch a play. Uh, 
most important building. <laughs> nah. Awesome. They got the flowers. So we live in Monte Cristo. Uh, it's also like Alta Brisa Mall is right down here. And then there's that field right there. And then there's also this school. Is this internet? It is international school. Yeah, right here. I mean, the cars be like packed all the way down the street. All oh, age ranges. Hold on, let me see his play. Let me see his play. Hold up. Hey. Ooh. 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 Oh, gosh. I might have to get out there. Buddy said all I had to do was go on Facebook and just like um, see if there's a team like Flag Football Merida. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do that. That sounds fun. But there's also these like little shops too. This is where uh, we got our nails done that one time. And the Fruteria is like pretty far. Nah, not pretty far, but like maybe another block down. But there's, you see all these like little shops off to the side, like, oh, that's a flower shop right there. And then, you you know, I don't know if you remember when we took uh, Julian to the pediatrician. Is that pediatrician that we went to? Yeah, the Star Medica is right over there. It's like right around the corner. And then there's a, a park up there too. You can see the Star Medica right there. Right there, Star Medica. So we're not far from a hospital. This place is new, it's opened up. Oh, a little dance, okay. Nina, yeah. Fruiteria time. They got dragon fruit? Nope. They got grapes? Nope. They got grapes? Yeah, grab some grapes. Ooh, they got these chips too. Oh yeah, we're gonna get some chips. When I saw this, uh, how do you say grapefruit? Not, not not hot. It's grapefruit. Grapefruit. Grapefruit juice. Oh, toronja. Toronja. Yeah, coconut water. Yeah, two coconut waters. Yeah. Those. <laughs> Those, yeah, Nina. That's how you say two. That's right. So I got the honey at the market for a hundred pesos. And here it's 120, so they just marked it out like 20 pesos. Some mangoes? Uh, if you want to get one, you can try it, see what it's like. Nina might like uh, watermelon. She really does like watermelon. So. Should I get a pineapple? You know how to pick pineapples? Yeah, you smell the bottom. And then my mom said something about the top too. She said you should be able to take a leaf out or something. So come in here. And I like the, the dragon fruit. Like if you get to any place, you get the dragon fruit lemonade, it's good. But sometimes it's a little sweet. So I don't like the sweet stuff, but the orange juice is usually good. And then the grapefruit juice is awesome too. Vegan, but we don't need popcorn. I have like a bunch of kernels at home and I pop really good popcorn. Nah, I think we're good. Oh, I said they had you. What this is. But yeah, it's, you really can get a lot of things. Um, just like the seasonings. I think that's garlic. No clue what that is. Anise, like star anise? Yeah. Yeah. Star, yeah. And uh, baking powder, baking soda, uh, oregano, and something else. And then just like staple stuff. Oh, it's time? Okay. And grapefruit juice. Do you want to continue to be afraid? No. Or do you want to try to get over it? Do you want to be like this or do you want to be afraid? I want to be afraid. Okay, so every time you come through here, you're going to be... <laughs> or do you want to try and figure out how to deal with your fear? I'm trying to figure out how to He's not we're going doing, to. We're doing... Look, hold my hand. It's okay. Look, relax. Breathe. Relax, relax, okay? It's all right, okay? You're not gonna be hurt, okay? Get Come as close me. to it as you can without touching Get it. Get as close to it as you can without touching it. Don't touch it. 
Okay. Closer. Closer. As close as you can. Closer. Oh, spider. There is a spider. All right, let's do this one. Go over there, then. Come this one. All right, now look. See these flowers? You can touch these flowers. There's no spikes, all right? Mm -hmm. Right. You can touch the flowers. No spikes. It's okay. Mm -hmm. You can touch the leaf, right? Mm -hmm. Touch the leaf. Are you hurt? No, you're not. You see? But now the spikes, they are sharp. But if you touch them from the side, they're not going to poke you. So, like, as long as you don't touch the point, you're not going to get poked. Exactly. exactly, just like the knife. There's a sharp part and there's a dull part. So yeah. Try just, to touch the side. Yeah, you can touch the side. Right here, touch the side. Mm -hmm. Are you hurt? Are you hurt? You hurt? No, you're not. <laughs> Good job, Nina. And that's it. And then eventually... You can even, and you can even touch the sharp part very lightly. Look. Yeah, you can touch it just soft. It's very soft. But you have to be careful still with the, with the sharp parts. It's like the knife. But you can touch it soft. Do you want to try and touch it soft? Soft. Yeah! Look at you! Hey! I like that, man. High five. I want to touch it again. You can't do it. Go it. It's soft. And Cameron and Nina and me and my grandma all at once. <laughs> grapefruit juice, yeah. Yeah, look at that. I want my grapefruit juice now. Uh-huh. Uh, Meredith, it's not slow, but it's calm. It's like relaxed. Like, I don't know, like in the States, if you had a plumber, they're like, yeah, we'll be at your house at like, you know, we'll be there the 8 a.m. on Tuesday. It's a lot more relaxed here, so they might just be like, uh, yeah, Thursday or Friday, we'll come, and then like, Maybe Thursday they'll message you and be like, oh, when are you free? Or they'll just be like, they won't even ask you sometimes. They'll just be like, we'll be there in the afternoon. Yeah. And then it's you just kind of like waiting for when they're around. Okay. I think one friend was saying when he got here, he was like, oh, snap, what do we do? And the thing is, like, I'll, I'll be busy, man. I'll have a lot to do. I'll be at Jiu-Jitsu. Nina got school. Then, you know, it's like I want to take her to homeschool in the morning so we go to the English library. And then also there might be a birthday party on the weekend. And then another friend want to hang out. Then we might go to Los Gio. And I work. Well, kind of. <laughs> sort of. You kind of have to find your group. Yeah, groups of expats, but then also locals, you know. Like, you know, you found your family in the gym, really. Yeah, like getting involved. Like if you like sports, there's definitely a lot of things you can do to like do that and meet people but there's also the english library is a good way to meet we're almost done it's a good way to meet locals too because they have events where like they invite locals and have discussion or like help you learn spanish if you have kids and getting um involved with the parents or meeting families and honestly people are just really friendly like we met a family just at the beach there's events all the time there's vendors like there's yoga classes you can go to there's um like art groups things like that small events. markets there's markets market, all over yeah the place. there's a bunch of stuff unleash the nina go nina get to the bathroom go 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 you can do it Yo, how she get so fast If, if you like this video, please subscribe and more curiosity time.